Hi, Wayne from Furnace Doctors here, and you're not fancy, no frills, no special effects uh, post about uh, different ideas for indoor air quality. One of the questions we get is what is indoor air quality? And then the other question is what do we do for indoor air quality? Well, one of the first things is UV lights. One of the easiest things to understand or to or most popular is UV lights. Here's an example is a product called Breathe Clean. As you can see, these lights go off of the end of it. This goes in, into your furnace above where your AC coil is. Uh, we install these. Now, the easiest way to think about this is these will turn on and I'm not gonna plug it in because they get extremely bright and it'll blind both me and you. Uh, the is, think of different uh, dust or bacteria and as vampires. And this is a UV light, just like in the movies, that attack and kill vampires. And that's what these do. They go and they zap them, make them essentially dead. And again, I'm not going into scientific terms or anything like that, but these go very bright. The air with your dust goes over it and then goes out into your home. But that dust is basically uh, made inert. And so, and the allergies and the viruses and bacteria that might be going over this are created or basically killed. So wherever they go into your home, there is, it kills allergies and that's the idea behind this. Um, the thing I don't like about UV lights is that they do require uh, maintenance. In other words, you do need to replace them every year or two, depending upon your system. Some say one, some say two. Uh, they start losing their oomph and basically you have to replace these, which requires ongoing um, cost with these. Another idea other than these, and we do install all of these if you ever have an issue like that. Another item is what you can use and they use ions. And again, I'm not getting into the scientific stuff with this. Um, I try and keep these broadcasts or these posts something that I would like to watch and very keep it very low level. And that's what most people want is these are a couple different ideas. Uh, this one is a uh, I wave. And the I wave here is uh, designed where it's ions that are going in, going out, and they're attaching themselves to uh, the viruses and the bacteria and the dust. So it's going out there and attaching itself and clumping it together, also making it inert, killing it essentially. Uh, this is one that I've had in my home too. It has a little self cleaner on it. Uh, basically, these two posts right here work together and send ions out and then gather the dust or go out there and kill the product. Uh, this little bar here is also cleans it, kind of goes around and cleans these so they don't get clumped up. This gets installed down by your blower motor. So in essence, in essence what's happened is the air is going by it and then these ions are attaching to any of those items that I mentioned going up into the home. The one thing that people notice on these is it tends to look like you have more dust in your home. It's not that you have more dust, it's the fact that these ions are clumping the dust together so it's looking bigger. And what it does is then it falls out of the air, you can clean it up off of surfaces, your air filter works better. So initially it looks like you have a lot of dust all over. But over time that should clear up and you should know, start noticing less dust. So that's the idea with that. Uh, these other item, the other item is what we have called a plasma. Uh, it is ion plasma system. Same concept. Uh, you can kind of see the different posts on there. Sends the ions out there. The difference between these two, essentially is this one's a lot more money. This one is less money. This one says no maintenance, but this one has just come out relatively new, say no maintenance. And both of these 
should be no maintenance. So what does that mean? Essentially about the same price when you purchase it. This one, you plug in and you forget. You put it in down by your blower motor. If your housing cabinet is made of metal, you have little magnets on here. And if it's made of plastic, which like American Standard, some of the new trains, uh, the housing's plastic, you can also attach it down there. And you plug it in down there for power, forget it. These are great. I've had these in my home too. Again, this is another item that will make it look like your home is dustier. But what it does is bigger dust going out there, clumping and falling to the surface instead of floating around that you see in the sun. Basically, what's good is having a good air furnace filter to filter this out. We also have another item that I did not bring out today. It's called an air scrubber. It uses UV, or not UV, sorry, uh, ozone in the home. I like that. A lot of people don't. Not very many people do like that, so we don't even bring that product out. Don't sell much of that. But in essence, you do have three items here that are very good to help you with air quality. One of the important things though is also make sure that you do change your furnace filter on a regular basis because these are going to uh, work great with a good filter. And I've posted before about the type of filter you should have. Uh, these are some great product. I'm Wayne with Furnace Doctors, your no frills post. Hopefully it makes sense to you. Uh, we do have all these items. Give us a call, go to our website if you do have uh, further questions. Uh, furnace-doctors.com and we do have some other items for you. Have a great day.